A violent case of road rage that we first showed you on the 4th of July. A driver shoots at a family's truck, setting off fireworks, injuring a couple and their two young children. Fast forward to today, and that suspect in that shooting, just 18 years old, faced a judge. The charge against him, aggravated assault with a deadly weapon. Our Sally Mamdu live near the scene of that incident with what happened in court. Sally. Dominique, it was in this gas station where we saw those fireworks go off inside the truck where a family or four were inside at the time. And it was all because of a, uh, an argument over a parking spot. And now the man turned himself in and he says he's remorseful. Harris County investigators say 18-year-old Baron Rivera is the man behind the shooting that led to this truck catching fire with a family inside burning them severely. Rivera turned himself in Sunday night, telling investigators he felt remorseful. Mr. Rivera, you've been charged with two aggravated assaults and then two aggravated, aggravated assaults with a deadly weapon and two aggravated assaults serious bodily injury. Investigators say it all stemmed from an argument over a parking spot at a fireworks stand on July 4th. The defendant stated that the victim cut him off and then talk trash to him at the stoplight. Investigators say Rivera followed the victim's truck to a gas station and then pulled an AR-15. The victim sees the defendant grab a gun, so he enters his vehicle and begins to leave the parking lot back onto West Mount Houston. The defendant then fires several rounds, striking the victim's vehicle, causing the fireworks inside the vehicle to ignite. Today, a judge set Rivera's bond at $200,000, despite his defense attorney's request during his first court appearance for the bond to be reduced. Your judgment was bad, which makes me believe that the safety of the community is paramount in this type of situation. The mother has been released from the hospital. However, the father is still being treated for his injuries, as well as the two children. They're still going through surgeries. For now, we're live in North Harris County. Sally Mabdu, KPRC, Channel 2. Thank you, Sally.